everyone, I wanted to do a quick video showing you a demo of something I've been working on for three years. Um, I rewrote this in Sapper and Svelte, and this is an Arduino IDE with a simulator that uses Blockly, and it's really cool. So what you do is you drag um, blocks into the loop. So I'm going to drag this um, turn LED on block, and you can see it's turning on LED 2, and that's turning on the LED that's connected to pin 2 right here. It generates a circuit and you can move all this stuff around and it also prints out the steps so right now it's going to run through the loop virtually three times so it's printing it out three times and you can click on it um, let's say we wanted to move it to pin seven we wanted to wait a second so we're building the classic blink pattern i can right click and duplicate and we'll turn it off and i'll right click again and duplicate and we'll Wait a second. So this will create a blink pattern. And what's cool is that you can, it's kind of like video editing, so you can step through it one at a time. You can see it goes on and off and it goes through the loop, which is pretty cool. It also generates the code um, right here. And you can see the code is uh, right here. So this is the actual code the Arduino will run. You can upload the code. So if I click this button, it'll upload the code. I'm going to select my the one that has USB in it. Sometimes it's different for different OSs. I'm going to click Connect, and it's uploading. It usually takes about 10 seconds to upload, um, which is pretty cool. We also have two different boards, the Uno and the Mega. We're going to add more boards later on. I'll give it another second. OK, so now it's uploaded, which is really cool. also have tons of lessons that you can go through. And you just click on a lesson, and then it um, gives you the thing for the lesson click through the steps and all that stuff and you can even resize it which is pretty cool and this is all built this is actually a uh, Swelt component believe it or not so this is a uh, Swelt web component all right uh, you can open projects you can even save projects so this is built with Firebase so if I sign in um, and I'll sign into my account you can see um, if I click open, you can see all the projects I have, and obviously I have a lot of projects, but you can filter them, and you can even um, open a project file if you want as well. And we could save this. I could say example, example blink. I could put a little description, and it would save. And now if I go here, you can see I've got the project ID right here. And yeah, so that's the project. I can switch between, so that's the uh, Mega as well. And all of them have uh, these little helpful question things. So if you're ever confused about what a block does, you can just click on them, which is pretty cool. Um, got project settings right here. This is the settings page. So if I don't like the background color, I can change that, which is really cool. So we'll select a pink just for fun. If I go back here, you can see now it's pink. And you can also control uh, the color that the LEDs would be. So if we wanted this to be uh, orange, try to get an orange. There we go. If I went back here, yeah, so now it's orange. And then this uh, this needs to be more clear, but this is the maximum amount of time that it'll wait per, per block. So if we did like... 10 you, so that's like 10 milliseconds so that's why it needs to be more clear but you can see like it'll go pretty fast so it only waits as a maximum for 10 it does wait the full second though in between you can also click on these steps as well um, which is cool so and if you're never if you're not happy with any, uh, the settings you made you can just click reset and it'll go back to what it was so that's really cool uh, that's the logout button and yeah i just wanted to show you this demo I have a new youtube channel as well as a discord and um, yeah if you have any questions or any feedback or you want to contribute to this project uh, let me know it is a swelton and sapper project so um, feel free to do so and uh, i look forward to hearing your feedback i will catch you all later